Hi guys, welcome back. And although in this video all we're going to end up with is a rectangle, there's actually a few more construction lines and things to keep track of than you would expect. So let's see how it works and give it a go now. Okay, so here is what a rectangle is going to look like once it's been fully constructed. Um, so as you can see, we've got 15 centimeters across as the width on the bottom and then 11 centimeters for our height. Um, so let's see how this is done now. So our first step is just going to be to draw our 15 centimeter line straight across. So this is our first side length, and we're just going to go straight horizontal with this. So that's 15 there. And now we're just going to grab our protractor, and for both sides, we're just going to make a mark at 90. So at the top here on the left, we're going to have a mark at 90, and make sure it's nice and clear for the examiner to see that you did in fact use your protractor. So uh, we have 90 here on both sides. And now we're going to use our ruler again to make um, these extensions here from the bottom left vertice up as a construction line up towards the top. So give ourselves plenty of room in this construction line here on the left and on the right as well. And our final step is going to be to grab our compass and just set this compass length to be 11, which is our other side length. So uh, we just use our compass to get it to be 11 here like this. And we're going to swing this from the bottom vertice. So we have 11 centimeter arcs on both sides. And it's going to intersect on our construction line, which will give us our top two corners. And finally, we're just going to join these two corners so that we have a completed rectangle. So we're just going to join across and that is it for a rectangle. And that is the end of this construction and I'll see you next time.